Why I Deleted My Instagram Posted by Hannah in Wonderland I'm a 17-year-old girl, and so much like every other 17-teen-year-old girl, I envy the gorgeous girls on Instagram, Tumblr and Twitter that get hundreds and hundreds of likes and comments on their photos. I wanted to be just like them. I bought extensions, fake eyelashes, made my account private so people would have to follow me to see my pictures. I even started losing weight to be just as thin and pretty as all those other girls. And it worked. Hashtag after hashtag, and post after post of me smiling with thick winged eyeliner, and push-up bras made my follower count skyrocket. I loved the attention. I loved having random boys comment on my pictures about my looks and womanly assets. That is, until I got one strange follow request. I clicked on the username, let's just call it John001, and it took me to an account page which displayed no profile photo, no posts, no followers and no one they followed. But as I said prior, I wanted followers, so who was I to give a shit about the freaky page? I accepted the request and went on as normal. A week later I received my first comment from a strange account. John 001, hot. I didn't think much of it as more than half the time I received comments on photos they were from people I didn't actually know in real life. However the next morning I woke up to see the account had like 36 of my photos dating from as far back as 32 weeks ago. It was strange, sure, but as I said I was just happy to be getting likes. Now this is where things start to get weird. On April 1st I got a phone call from a private number, and of course I was curious so I answered. Hello? Hey. It was a guy's voice, very, very deep and husky. I kept talking trying to recognize the voice. May I ask who is calling? I'm on the phone a lot at work so I just have a tendency to be very proper during phone conversations. Is this Hannah? The voice questioned. My eyebrows shot up at the sound of not only my first, but my last name as well. Whoever it was definitely knew me. Uh, this is she, who's this? Where are you right now? Uh, what? Are you at home? I want to make you scream. Who is this? I was freaked out. Who the fuck was this? Laughs Hannah or right? You gotta be a nice ass. I hung up. They called again. But by this point I figure haha April fools lol I get it haha right? So I ignore the next three calls and disregard it as some weird April 1st prank. But the next morning I was woken up by the same private caller. This continues for nine more days, receiving two calls at the same time each and then suddenly it stops. It was silly anyways, definitely just a joke. I forgot all about it. A week later I got a notification on my Instagram account. John001 tagged you in a photo. I clicked on the thumbnail to get a better view. It was a picture of me driving in my mom's van. I was sitting at a stoplight. I clicked back to the user's account. One post. Zero followers. Following one. No profile picture. I started to freak out and showed it to my sister. We both started freaking out and I reported the photo as inappropriate. The private call started up again. I answered once and never touched the phone again. All the voice said was, Did you like my picture? Two days later, but John001 still continued to tag more and more photos of me, one of me leaving work, one of me at the mall and the last one, just a photo of my street. I showed the post to my mom and she told me that if it were to happen again then she would call the police, but she swore it was just a friend trying to freak me out. She was probably right. I remember thinking as I went upstairs and turned on the radio. I was busy blaring system of a down when my mom called up to me that she was taking my sister to dance and was bringing my brother along for the ride. I of course didn't hear her. I made my way into the bathroom carrying my loud music at my side. I hopped in the shower screaming along to the radio. I didn't hear the front door when it opened. I didn't hear him come up the stairs. 
I didn't even hear him when he went into my room and used my red lipstick that I had used in so many Instagram pictures to write on my mirror. But I did hear the click of the camera as I turned my naked body to read the note that covered my reflection. It read in those smeared crimson letters, Smile Hannah.